Hey, Salak, yeah. Um, yeah, you're on enemy lines. You're on enemy, enemy's territory, okay? You're a POW. So right now, we are able to... Um, this is how you know the, um, your enemy is losing power. Because we're not in, um, in hardship. We're in bondage still. Our physical, but our mind is free. Because we understand what it's about. So that means when you understand what it's about, that means you got to walk with wisdom. You can't be walking around here with your, with your fringes out all day, every day. You got a fringe. You got the, um, man, I probably would have been fired already. Them motherfuckers hate me. <laughs> My job. They fucking hate the brown on me. They hate me so much, they still won't. They relentless, yo. My little bit of my little check compared to they big checks, it still kills them inside, man. Because you know what, know what it is? It's not the money; it's the glow they see around me. And that goes for all of us, man. Wisdom shining. Your wise judgment, how you conduct yourself, shines in front of them, and they don't like it. They still hate how you carry yourself. You always you're polite. You know. You're, you're generous. And they're looking at you. What type of man is this? And they look for anything to fuck you up. One mistake, they will come down. They will try to come down with you hard. So that's why you got to always work with wisdom. The instru- we follow in the instruction of Yahweh Shem Shah. First step, he wants you to fear him. Then he will reveal everything. You still fear Yahweh Shem Shah? And you understand, it's just all about what he wants. He's going to reveal everything else to you. And I, I truly believe that. Based upon fear. And you have Shah. Proverbs chapter 15, verse 33. The fear of Yahweh Shemel Shah is instruction of wisdom. And before honor is humility. And you be, we being, hey, we being, we being humiliated, man. Certain so things, you just think about it, man. They won't stop, bro. You know, our, our fears leader, right? <laughs> um, Biden, right? He used to talk about black people all bad about black folks all the time. And they go stand in your face, act like he did something good for you. All right? So we we being humility, humility, honor. Before honor is humility. So there's a um, there's an order to this, man. All right. So just got another one, right? It says we're gonna read the same one. Right? Proverbs chapter sixteen, verse. Salakia. Yeah. Proverbs chapter sixteen, verse six. By mercy and truth. Iniquity is purged and it's happening by mercy. Yahweh was was giving us mercy to come back to him. And truth. The truth is being revealed. I love this verse. Right? We're gonna go to it real fast. I brought this out to find it. Because it is growing, man. And it can't hide. If, if the Lord allowed me to find it. I don't forgot. I kind of kind of forgot where it was at. But let's see if I can find it. Um, It just came in my head. And kind of, I'm fighting right now. Hold on. Salaki. It was, you know, it's a famous verse right now. You know, eight, is it 6 and 28? I think so. Because it's happening, man. It really is happening, man. And Dewali Abba Shemel Shah. Oh, I got it. Dewali Abba Shemel Shah for the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. Because I was just telling my daughter yesterday that. I was just telling her. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to be honest. I said, the Lord Abba Shemel Shah got me with the greatest men on the earth. That's something to boast into. I'm telling you, man. Second Ezra chapter six, verse twenty-eight. Hold up. 
All right, let's go up a verse because we just talked about um, we did, we did the verse we just read before that. How we started off is, is look what he's talking about. Look, hold on. We're going to start at verse 27. All right. At Second Ezra chapter 6, verse 27. For evil should be put out. See? So their evil tidings is going to be put out. They, they, they news that, that they're trying to push, they own um, rumors, is going to be put out. For evil should be put out. And the seat shall be quenched. See? The slander was going to be cool. <laughs> He's gonna quench, he's gonna be quenching fire. As for, as for faith, it shall flourish. Corruption should be overcome. I'm telling you, it's happening, man. These things is happening, bro. Why you why you know it's happening? Because they keep messing with videos. Why are you messing with videos if it's a lie? And for the and so like and the truth, which has been so long without fruit, so be declared so that's what's happening man these things is happening that's right right by mercy because it's mercy the lord is having mercy on us man Pro back to proverbs proverbs chapter 16 verse 6 by mercy and truth iniquity is purged and by and by the fear of yahweh our shah Man, depart from evil. See, they evil titans. We don't worry about it. the Lord's going to depart us from that, man. I just told you. See, look, Proverbs chapter nineteen, verse twenty-three. If you fear Yahweh Shemuel Shah, he will, he will tend to you. The fear of the Lord Yahweh Yahweh Shah tendeth to life, and he that has it shall abide. Satisfied, right? Satisfied. So like it. The word just fell out of my head. Look like it. Satisfied. Yes, yes. So like it. Satisfied. He should not be visited with evil. The Lord is gonna protect us, man. That's why I'm saying when I see stuff like that, the little girl coming out of there, she's like, we, they probably told us we we we're doing the movie. We're gonna be in the scene. I don't trust these people, man. Proverb, hey, because we're gonna be, it's gonna be a lot more things happening, man. Proverbs chapter twenty-two, verse four: By humility and the fear of Yahweh Shemuel Shah are riches, bro. Humility is, is is a substance, man. And this society, you supposed to be humility, because the next one you're gonna be everything, man. See, this is about this is about becoming everything. Be up, because they trying to, they trying to, um. These guys just trying to put um, all this stuff inside you, right? Well, we're going to give you this, and then you're going to be able to walk. Well, you gave it to me. That means it's going to be a malfunction. <laughs> By humility and fear of Yahweh Osha are riches. And honor and life, man. That's life source, bro. I don't know. I just, these verses just popping up right here in Proverbs. Look at this. Uh, yeah, man. Because, yo, these people running around here, they, they trying to put the unfloor night and the floor night, the ones without, the ones that didn't dance with floor night and girl, they trying to um, make them the bad guys. And the ones that dance with floor night and girl, the good guys. But you're going to, you, you're not even real no more. You know? Now think about that. Let Proverbs chapter 23, verse 17. Let not thy heart envy sinners, but be thou in the fear of Yahweh Shemel Shah all the day long. Yeah, man. That's right. So 
So we ain't gonna worry about all that, man. That's the, that Salakia in her um Salakia. Alright. Proverbs chapter one twelve verse seven. He should not be afraid of evil tidings. His heart is fixed, fixed in Yahweh Shem trusting in Yahweh Yahusha. His heart is established. He, he should not be afraid until he see the desires upon. We're going to see the desires. We should not, we, I mean, Salakit. Our heart is established in who? Yahweh Shem he should not be afraid until he until we un, we should not be afraid until we see our desires upon our enemies. That's right. So until we see the desires of our enemies. Oof, wow. I'm gonna read this last one. Psalm chapter 93. That's why we ain't gotta worry, man. It's really crazy though. It's crazy, it's mind boggling. It's gonna be the ultimate story in the kingdom, man. We go, this is gonna be a movie to always I don't know how it's gonna be played out, but it just it just feel like it's gonna be something. To always watch. Man. My eyes also. Psalm 92 verse 11. My eyes shall also see the desires. My eyes also shall see my desires. Our eyes also shall see our desires on our, on our enemies. And our ears shall hear our desires of the wicked that raised up against us. We're going to hear them squirm and twiddle and gnash. Why? Why do? Why well, we can't get you back? And we're going to remember everything you've done to us, man. That's. See, the Lord have mercy on us and make us forget. Right? But you're not going to forget. You're gonna remember every taste, everything you have done, every um what was the word every taunting you have done, every wicked thing you have done, you're gonna remember and you wanna know why you can your ass your 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 butt handed to you. Shit. So uh, yeah. I like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yahweh Shemel Shah Bashim Kakwadash. Why Yahweh Shemel Shah for the apostles and the elders a great millstone. Shalom to the Akim. Shout out